Hello everyone, my name is Penguin Stew, and today we'll be playing Passing Pineview Forest. I, I do not like horror games. Just a camera here. I do not like them, they are scary. You'll notice I'm not using my flashlight. That would give away my position to any enemies in the area. And by enemies, I mean monsters and ghosts and other scary crap that's out here. Going the right way? Was this supposed to go the other way? This is the way I was facing. Okay, that was something in the trees. Oh, this music. That's just now. Oh, there is a run key. It is shift. It wasn't a uh, controls menu or anything. See what everything was, so. I know it's a flashlight. Of course, see, if I use a flashlight, it kills my night vision. I think. Yeah, it looks like that's how it works. Makes it hard to see stuff outside of your outside of the light circle. I know it could just be in my head. And that's the whole point of horror games, right? To get it into your head. Oh you're here, I'm just walking on the path, passing the forest. Is that no it's a tree? I don't know if any of you have ever actually been out in the woods at night when it's overcast and cloudy, but you can't see a darn thing. Oh sh <laughs> Breathe, people and Steve. Just breathe. It's just music. It's just creepy music. Creepy music can't hurt you. Reminds me of a uh, old Ray Stevens song. Something about uh, sitting up with the dead. I ain't sitting up with the dead no more. I don't know about you. I ain't sitting up with the dead no more. Cause the dead started sitting up too. It was something like, uh, the dead can't hurt you cause they already left. But what they left can sure make you hurt yourself. Why am I on this road at night? Why am I going into this house? Is, this... Is that a baby? Yeah, that's a baby. That's my baby, though. It's not the game. Why 
am I snooping around this person's house? Because I'm curious. Hello? Can I use a... Can I use the phone? I'm in trouble on the stairs, though. This place has not been cleaned in some time. Well, that's an interesting noise. Like something crawling around in slime. I gotta remember to sign out of steam whenever I'm doing these recordings. <laughs> I'm almost here too, buddy. I swear I heard footsteps and saw somebody. Somebody wearing a blue shirt. I'm gonna have to look at this. And see if there was actually something there if I just scared myself. <laughs> This is a scream like a man, though. I mean, I'm not going to get any viewers because I'm not, like, screaming like a girl. Like Pootie Pie. But, uh, you know, I'm not going to freak out and pause the game and, like, oh, and, like, calm down either. The game is supposed to scare me. I must keep going through the fear. Or hide or something. I don't really have a uh, much of a flight response. Um, kind of default to kill switch engage. <laughs> uh, so, uh, games where they don't let you have weapons and different things really freak me out. Because you're completely powerless. Harry Potter bedroom. I mean, under the stairs closet. Okay, I'm getting stuck on the stairs. What was that? There's nothing. Oh, look, it's a baby bed. Can you open this stuff? Is it... Like I said, I didn't find any, like... Oh! Yeah, see, that's why I'm not using my flashlight. See, use the flashlight, you lose your, uh, night vision. Now, in the Marine Corps, what we learned to do during the night infiltration course was, uh, you keep one eye closed. Now, I don't remember if it was the left or the right. Because that was, like... I don't know, almost 10 years ago now. No, it's been over 10 years. Why am I getting in this closet? And that looks like there's a path that way. But there's also... We're going this way. Well, 
looks like this is just a little uh, loop de loop. Sure, you can go right or left, but it still goes to this group of stuff. Let's double time it through here. Oh, look, a birdhouse. That's nice. This isn't so scary. Of course, I'm not straying from the path either, but. You know, you start going off the path and. get lost in the woods. Nobody wants to get lost in the woods. and hide. Something on the path. No. Did I just step on something? I started a squeak toy. Hmm. I didn't see anything. I should just be flashlight on the rock. This thing needs some batteries. Interesting factoid, it actually takes about 30 minutes to regain full night vision. I mean, depending of course how bright the uh, light was in the first place. There it is again. Sort of squeaky toy. Sounds like I keep stepping on it. Another split path. Do we take the dark creepy one or the one that's lit up? The one that's lit up. <laughs> I'm a very practical person. I'm not a thrill seeker. Okay, footsteps in this week. Somebody who's invisible is sneaking up to me. Not very well because I can hear them. They're walking up to me and doing a squeak toy by my ear. Is it just like a little V thing? Is there anything back here? Okay, now I'm getting stupid. Let's 
Let's double time back to where we were. Okay. Alright, Mr. Squeaky Man. What is this, an old Spanish mission? So when were these these uh, missions made? 18th century, usually. I think. I know, I know I've seen them like westerns and stuff. I'm getting a little used to the squeaky toys, so. Is that a texture thing, or is that like supposed to be eyes looking at me? I'm not sure if texture bug or scary stuff. <laughs> It's a dwarf head. Is that a stone tree? No, it looks like a real tree growing through the stone. That's weird. This thing is kind of crazy. Okay, uh. Make a dwarf. Odd. What is that? I wonder what's over the path. Hey, you know what? It'll be fine. I'll just go over here to this little ridge thing. Just take a, take a little quick gander over. Okay, yeah, so that's like mountains. Some sort of little animal in the brush. As we all know, most animals are like nocturnal and stuff. So let's uh, let's check out what's over over this way. We have another path. Not many okay, so apparently this uh, this forest is about thirty feet wide. Thirty to fifty feet wide. Whoa! Mm. That a scarecrow. Why? Why would you put a scarecrow here? Who would do such a thing? Let's go for the. I, is that thing turning? Is it watching me? Oh, it was watching me. Oh, that's creepy as crap. I do not want to take my eyes off that thing. But I, I gotta look where I'm going. Oh, it was watching me. Let's get away from it. I think it's following us. We can play since he kills, so I'm gonna keep checking my six. Sure, I don't have...
I mean, if it can move its head, it can do anything. Right? <laughs> That's how I feel too, buddy. Ugh. Ugh. All right, well, that will conclude <laughs> that will conclude this playthrough. Uh, thank you for watching. My name is Penguin Stew. If you want to see more, subscribe, hit the like button, and, um, yeah, although I, I can't say that I'm going to do a whole lot more like this, because holy crap. But if you comment and you say, hey, I want to see you, like, scare the crap out of yourself and your kids while playing these scary butt games, I will, uh, I will oblige you. So, let me know. Thank you for watching. Stay classy, internet. <laughs>